Hey guys, welcome back to Vito's Garage. Today, uh, me and Spencer, we're going to look at this uh, 1985 Mercedes 500 SEL W126 that's been sitting for 10 years. Apparently, uh, uh, you know, somebody's grandpa passed away 10 years ago and it was, it's been sitting ever since. We're gonna go and see if we can buy it and save that car. That would be pretty cool. So we'll take you guys along. Ready, Spencer? Let's do it. All right, let's do it. Oh, 06 last registration that's crazy very cool oh yeah this one is a long body too I have a 79 at home and oh, shit. I was sitting for seven years and we got it to fire up a couple weekends ago. Oh, I bet you get this one to fire. You need to be cleaning the batteries though. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice. That's cool. Yeah. Oh, five. That's crazy. Let's try to fire it up right now. Drive it home like this. I don't think they have a what battery. There's a battery, but. It's a nice Jeep. Oh, thank you. I had this same kind of Jeep when I was pulling out of my garage with my head up like this, and I didn't think it would hit, hit it. Bent these brackets and everything. Bent the hood a little for the toe, so. I'll buy it either way, whether it's yeah, good. it's awesome. That's awesome. Look at this big yeah. vacuum booster. That's crazy. Used to make amazing cars back then. It's like every time I come out, I yeah. start my Jeep up because it lives out here with my parents. Yeah. It's like sure. every time I come out, I'm like, have you charge this up? Yeah. <laughs> I got an Intimidator battery for my Tacoma and I'm on five years now. That's good. And it's, it was maybe $50, $75 more than like the, get the, the regular one. I mean, one, if so. you get the gel cell ones, you know, the Optima yeah. or the fucking, yeah. there's another brand out there. The Optima are pretty nice. But they're... Yeah. That's not bad. Right, guys so we're currently waiting on the tow truck uh, to get here um we just bought this car not me but spencer spencer is adding this amazing w126 mercedes to his collection so uh he just called the tow truck uh company and the tow truck will be here soon so we will pick up this car unfortunately we were not able to start it because the battery is super dead and 
you know, we don't have any tools with us, but it's pretty amazing. We saved another classic Mercedes. So hopefully you guys are doing the same thing. Hopefully you guys are saving classic cars. More cars for sale right here. Toyota Camper right there, pretty cool. Really nice. Yeah, the, these these things have been here forever. So this car is super cool. Even came with the owner's manual and with the maintenance booklet. It's really cool. It's got the steering wheel and everything. The seats are pretty amazing, actually. It just needs a lot of cleanup. It's a brand new car because mm -hmm. I had to take him back and forth to the doctor. So we bought a SUV, mm -hmm. you know, something he could so get in and out. Yeah. So you're technically a second owner of this yeah, car. I yeah, I think so. Yeah. I think That's so. pretty awesome. But it drives nice. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully tonight, after we get it home, we will start it. Yeah, and get all the dirt yes, out of it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Blow the dirt. Yeah. Look at that. Woo! Don't be scared, buddy. <laughs> That's cute. All right, guys, so there's the machine. We're still waiting for the tow truck to show up, but the owners were super nice. They actually moved this car outside. So, yeah, it's about, I think, 5 o'clock right now, and uh, it's getting, uh, uh, it's still pretty hot, but we're still waiting on the tow truck, and then hopefully we'll get this car home tonight. Do you remember how many miles it had when, when you guys first bought it? Just like curious. I don't. I think it has it on the title. I want to say two twenty five. I want to. I think the title says two twenty. No, like when you guys first bought it. Like this. In, yeah, yeah. That's what the mileage was. Oh really? Two oh five. Two oh six. Two oh six. And it's got two sixty nine on it now. Yeah. So you guys didn't drive it at all, pretty no, much, right? They didn't That's drive it. Crazy. I mean, miles I, I want to say they they drove a couple times years. to San Diego to come see us and yeah. such. But they, you know, I think they went to Vegas a couple times, San Diego, but not. They didn't drive not it. Not much. You know? That's pretty yeah. crazy. Yeah. Do you guys know like uh, why the car was parked? Like, uh, you, know, you guys I, didn't want to drive it anymore, or just, no, oh, it was your dad, I think right? it was missing or doing something, and then my dad had never worked on Mercedes before, so he started to. But then it was like, oh, I gotta buy my mom another car, and then, yeah, yeah, you know. And then it got sat, and then it pushed in the corner. Yeah, she was kind of saying she mentioned that they needed a re reliable vehicle to take him to doctor's appointments. Yep. So. I imagine if he's being taken to doctor's appointments, then to dig in to start working yeah. on this is not like <laughs> trying to get him not, not an easy task yeah. or anything. Yeah. But trying I mean, to get yeah. him not to. Oh, it's funny too because yeah. I had I had my other Jeep here, and I'm like, hey, I gotta take my Jeep home because I gotta get it smogged, you know, in California. And he goes, oh, are you, are you taking it out? He would bitch about it all the time, but he'd be like, oh, are you taking it home? Oh, oh, I need it because I was gonna pull some more. Time, so. <laughs> <laughs> And then when I bought this Jeep, he was like, well, why don't you just register here and leave it here? I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah. And there she is, guys. Beautiful machine. Original wheels. Really nice color. Really amazing. Yeah, it has two shifter bushings that probably need to be replaced. Yeah, but uh, the rear wheels are spinning, right? If the rear wheels are spinning, then it should be fine. I don't think they, are. I don't think they were dragging. 
Yeah. I think they were okay. This side was. Oh, well, that's like that side was. Yeah. Okay, well let's let's try it again. See what happens. Nah, it don't matter. Actually. Yeah, it's probably if anything, it probably it's a stuck caliper. If anything, let's see if it's dragging. It's spinning. It's yeah, it's good. All right, guys, we're currently driving back. The car is on the tow truck. Uh, we're driving back to Spencer's place and uh, the tow truck should be there anytime soon too. So um, it's getting late, but we'll probably have a lot of adventures tonight.